Hi everyone, I hope you're all well. So I've been trying to get a haul video done, um, but basically there's too much stuff for me to put into one haul video. So I think I'll have to do kind of two or three shorter ones. Um, so to start off with, I was just going to show you just a couple of things that I've um, picked up from Superdrug, just to let you know some deals that they currently have on, just in case you didn't know already. Um, and just kind of a random thing also that I picked up yesterday. Um, I picked up a lovely pair of gloves and they were from my local Tesco supermarket. Um, they're only £5 and they remind me, I was watching a video from Lana, Indiana, um, I think yesterday or the day before. Um, and she was showing um, some gloves that she had recently picked up. Um, but she got hers from Saks and they were much, much more expensive. Um, and hers were black leather, um, but I mean, the design is very similar. As soon as I saw these, it reminded me of her video. Um, so the, the gloves look like this. So I'll just put it on, actually. I'll show you. So it's kind of, it looks, that's how it looks, kind of on the inside. And then, as you can see, it has this really lovely bow, and it's got kind of like a stud um, stud design on the bow so if you've seen the video um, from Lana then you'll, you kind of see because the gloves that she was showing they're pretty much very very similar in design but hers are black and they're leather these are like a lovely brushed um, fabric let me see if it says what material it is mm -mm -mm. Uh, it's 100% acrylic but it's so so soft so warm I wore it earlier on to take the dog out for a walk and my hands were just lovely and toasty warm um, I did have another pair that were just absolutely useless um, so yeah they were just five pounds so if you're maybe looking for um, like a last minute gift idea or if you've got a friend or family member who has said that they need some more gloves then maybe definitely check something like that out just with the the bow it just makes it a bit more fun rather than just being a boring old pair of gloves so yeah five pounds guys really really lovely Okay, jokes. So that was like the random thing and then just all the other bits I'm going to show you um, in this haul are basically all from Superdrug. So they had a deal on, I went in, um, I think last week I went in and then I went, was it last week? Yeah, I went in last week and then I went in Tuesday this week as well. Um, so when I went in this week, they've got a deal on their, um, well, some of their skincare, and they had an offer on this particular one that's um, two for three pounds. So it's their vitamin E um, range, and the camera doesn't want to focus, but it's their vitamin E range. So this is their day moisturiser, and it has an SPF 15. And then I picked up um, basically for an extra penny, because this is normally 2 99 on its own. Um, then I picked up the skin oil that is also part of that same collection. And I've only used this a couple of days now, and I absolutely love it it's just amazing I mean it smells gorgeous just the smell of it there's something about it that reminds me a bit of the smell of baby oil that's just to me but the the general overall fragrance it just it's got such like a relaxing soothing fragrance you know you wouldn't put it on your face and kind of think oh you know that's kind of really awful because I use this just at night time, just as like an extra, um, not really a treatment, but just like extra moisture for my skin to kind of recover overnight. Um, and I wake up the next day and my skin is so, so soft. So this stuff is amazing. So yeah, these at the moment are two for three pounds. So I just thought I'd let you know about that. And then they also have, um, they've got on their cosmetics, they've got um, an offer of three for two. And so obviously the third item, like the cheapest item, will be free. Um, and so I went in, because I've nearly um, run out of my Bobbi Brown foundation, I went into, um, originally I was going to get a um, Revlon Colour Stay foundation, or whatever it's called, you know what I mean. Um, I was going to get that, but then I happened to see that they have the... Um, photo ready and so I picked mine up this is a colour that I got it's number 2 vanilla um, and it's 12 99 I, I noticed actually that the um, like the normal colour stay one has also gone up 
Um, now, I've used this maybe about four or five times. And um, I love the fact that it's got a pump. I really like that um, because I noticed that the other one doesn't. Um, and I'm used to having a pump from my um, Bobby Brown. So I love that it's got a pump and you know I kind of like how the packaging looks and everything um, and I like the consistency of when I pump the foundation out but I'm not sure I'm not sure if I'm, I'm just not used to the effect that this gives my skin or that I hate it. I just I haven't decided yet. I can't make up my mind. Um, it has almost like an iridescent finish to it um, so, I mean, it doesn't look like you've caked your face in shimmer, but if somebody was to get up close to you, then they could probably see just um, kind of the slight iridescence that it has. But for some reason, I, I don't know if it's just me, but the way it appears on my skin is it seems to almost make my dry skin, like my really dry skin areas, it seems to make them look worse. Um, I've found that it's not a very forgiving foundation. Um... I mean, ever since I've um, been off of my pill, then I'll just get a random breakout for no apparent reason, um, whether it's, you know, a monthly breakout or, or whatever. Um, and I found that this almost um, draws attention to a particular blemish. Um, I mean, if, the, if you've got like um, a spot or a blemish that isn't raised, then you can obviously conceal it with like a good coverage concealer and then it will be fine. But if it's like a raised um, blemish, like a spot, you know, they usually are, um, this almost draws attention to it, in my opinion. Um, but then I'm not sure if that's just because I'm aware of the fact that I've got a spot. But So, yeah, I'm not, I'm not sure on this yet. But so anyway, so I picked that up and then I found, or I... Um, read the um, sleek um, Christmas palette has come out so I definitely I, I called up uh, my local super jug and I checked that they had some in so the front of the packaging looks like this it's called sparkle and then the actual palette if you haven't seen the colors yet I love this they're the colors and look how much they absolutely shimmer and shine and sparkle it definitely is sparkle, like they've, they've called it, but look how the colour just dances off of them. Oh, I love it. I think the colours are beautiful. I definitely love that palette. I had to have it, even, you know, I've sort of got plenty of eyeshadows, but I had to, had to have it. So I got that, and then for my free item, um, I got, I am out of my normal um, eye makeup remover. And so I went back to using my, the Bourgeois, um, I won't even try and pronounce it, but it's basically the Express Eye Makeup Remover, and it removes waterproof mascara, um, so, yeah, it looks like that, you can see, like, the two different things, and you just shake it up, so, yeah, I got that for free, um, although, as with most three for twos, if, for example, you just wanted to stock up on your foundation, not necessarily this one, but, um, then you would pay for two and you'd get the third one that's the same price, you'd get that for free. So, yeah, and then the last thing I picked up um, was just like a medium size radial vent brush. Um, this is the sort of brush, when I went to the hairdressers some weeks ago and she cut my hair, this is the kind of brush that she used to actually blow dry my hair straight. Um, so, yeah, it was £2.50. Um, I've seen them for a lot more than that um, in the salon and online um, so I thought £2.50 you can't go wrong so yeah they're the bits that I've picked up so definitely guys maybe just check out um, if you need to get like some last minute um, gift ideas maybe some stocking fillers then they have got loads of different di um, deals and offers in Superdrug so definitely go down to your local Superdrug check it out um, I haven't been paid by Superdrug I'm not sponsored by them or anything like that so you know I'm just trying to pass on you know, I know that they've got some good deals on, so I'm just trying to pass that on to you. So, yeah, I thought I'd share that with you. Um, I'm now going to go and do haul number two. This is probably going to have to be like three separate videos, um, just because I talk too much and I couldn't fit it all into one. 
So yeah, um, I hope you're all staying nice and warm. I hope that none of you have sort of come down with a cold that seems to be going around. Um, I know that my husband recently had like a cold and a sore throat and stuff. So yeah, hopefully you're staying all nice and wrapped up warm and nice and well. Um, so yeah, have a good weekend guys and I'll see you all in my next video. Take care. Bye.